Oh, I bet you thought my Redbubble subscribers, I bet you guys were thinking, how dare he release a video without releasing a Redbubble video? Well, don't you worry because I've got you covered. Uh, I'm going to release that video. I think uh, the one that I just released about Jarvis, I might not even put notifications on so you don't even get a notification. This video is for my Redbubble subscribers. It was my most requested um, in the small poll that I did the other day. And this is going to be one hour unedited of me just doing pure Redbubble research. It's going to be using the search operator method um, most likely because using uh, the Ahrefs method is paid and I don't really want to just keep making videos about it because it's paid. So this is a free way to get incredible keywords for Redbubble. I'm going to make a spreadsheet and I'm going to release the spreadsheet to my Patreon, which you can join. It's uh, patreon.com slash income stream surfer. So yeah, feel free to join. I'm creating Redbubble lists on there. So this is going to go into this spreadsheet. You can also just write them yourselves if you want. But yeah, join the Patreon if you want. So how do we do this? The first thing we do is we put site and I already have my search operator. I will leave this in the description. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to go on tools and I'm going to put um, in the past week. In fact, I'm not going to do the past week because I've already done the past week in a video. So let's do past 24 hours. And then the other thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go on Ahrefs keyword generator. This is free. Okay, look, I am not signed in. It says start a free trial, but you do not have to in order to use this tool. And all I'm going to do, it's very, very simple, is I'm going to copy the keyword into Ahrefs and find keyword. As you can see, I'm not signed in and it's doing it for free. Uh, what? Oh, it's anime, isn't it? It's always anime. It's always anime. It's anime. Yeah, anyway. Uh, you can still, mm, I don't know if you can write the word. No, never mind. Just don't do it. It's copyright. Don't, don't mess with that. So before we put it into Ahrefs from now on, we're actually going to put it into Google first just to see if it's anime. I can't believe that's necessary. Yep, anime. Oh my god, I hate my life. <laughs> Stooped. I don't know what that means. Obviously, I skipped Gucci there. I'm going to try and explain everything I do. I, I skipped Gu Gucci for obvious reasons. I don't want you to just copy Gucci. It makes no sense. Please don't do that. Uh, what is this? Steps is no longer available. Steeped. Anime. Oh, God, whatever. Aho Girl. Ender Dragon. That's both anime. Blue's Clues. No. Darshan. You could probably make that. Chainsaw Man. What is that? Chainsaw Man. Oh, anime. <laughs> of course it's anime. It's always anime. No, my cat is working on my keyboard. This is unedited. Thank you. Please do not do that. I'm not a robot. I was temporarily a cat just then. <laughs> Canadian locations. That's an interesting one. It's probably going to have loads though. Oh, it doesn't have that many. Interesting. You could probably make some Canadian location stickers and maps and things. I'm gonna I'm gonna add that. I think that one is the kind of keyword that will sell internally on Redbubble. Uh, I'm just gonna stick it in. There we go. And let's go straight back to it. I'm not gonna put um, volumes. Oh, in fact, I, um, it depends on the keyword. Like, I really don't think Redbubble is going to be on the first page, anywhere near the first page. If you understand what search intent is, it's not. Of course, it's not. Um, maybe stickers, for example, would. Some people might search for that. I guess it's possible. Uh, you get the idea. For this particular keyword, because the search intent is all wrong, I'm not going to be checking. Balloon dog. Interesting. Um, a balloon dog sticker comes up here. Oh, no, that's my recent. Damn. Redbubble. Again, Redbubble's not here, but it's something that I could en en envisage people uh, searching for on uh, Redbubble. No, not paste for that. Pay, um, so like internally selling, I need to put that in a different window. This is the video that I'm currently uploading. <laughs> um, hmm. Full cow gifts. I don't know what that means. I think Napoli just scored. If you heard someone shouting there. Hmm. Oh, 
Ooh, interesting. What does that mean? Um, I, I don't know what that means. I'm putting that. I'm gonna ch I'm gonna check the volume on that for sure. Interesting keyword. Okay, yeah. That's not if that's not copyright, that's a really really good one. I leave it to you to check the copyright stuff. I'm trying my best to stay away from copyright, but it's your responsibility to check fully. Brooms are for amateurs riding horses. Interesting. I'm going to check Etsy as well. I'm also going to check Redbubble. Okay. I love that keyword. Eventually, this is going to start making me do a capture fairly soon. Really nice keyword. I'm putting that in. Uh, it's a Halloween one, but it's all good. It will sell during the year. Uh, black pink Lisa. Is this Lisa Simpson? Oh no, it's black pink. Obviously. Uh, Starbucks throw blankets. No. Goth titty. I have to check it. I have to say it's necessary. <laughs> it's for science. Um, t shirt. I'm going to write t shirt after so it doesn't come up with anything weird. Okay, perfect. Um,. Goth GF t-shirts. This would be a tag. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna check this. Oh no, it's gonna come up... Why am I checking this? It's gonna come up with what it always comes up with. But I don't... You know, is this like... Is this people trying to buy? Should I... Stuff in the chat. <laughs> oh god. Right. I just have a good feeling about this keyword, honestly. I'm going to put it in. I think some people are going to be looking to buy t-shirts. I'm not going to actually Google it because I don't want to. <laughs> but yeah, um, let's keep going. That was a good one. It's got a lot of volume. It's got a lot of potential. Bape bedding. What is bape? Please don't make me regret this. Nothing matches your search. Interesting. What is bape? Uh, 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 uh. So, oh, that's really clever. Bape bedding. Oops. Oh my god. It's a real thing. But it doesn't have any results on Redbubble. That's insane. What does, what does it mean? Let's have a look on Etsy to see if we can actually see what this means. Yeah, it's like this style. It's Vapor Brand. It's Vapor Brand. It looks like a brand. Yeah, it is. It is. It's a brand. But it also said Vapor's a style, so like you could make the argument that you're making it in um, the style of what it says here. Define Vape. Like, you can make it a design that's, like, really unappealing. Just, like, loads of colors or something. And then just call it Bape Bedding, and put, or Bape, um, whatever, and then put it on uh, put it on Redbubble. I'm going to add that as a keyword, because um, if you do it like that, it's not really copyright, I think. <laughs> Again, you have to check this yourselves. Like, I really don't know. Mid-Autumn Festival. Hmm... Hmm. It's got a lot of searches. Sticker. Interesting. Zero. Sure. It's going to start making me do the capture thing soon. No. Um, I think this could be an interesting one. Like, uh, again, selling through Redbubble. Like when people are on Redbubble and it's around that time of year, they might search for that. Let's stick it in. How how many minutes are we even in? 
we are 10 minutes in okay every 10 minutes I'm gonna switch it up a little bit so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna do Etsy.com uh, I need to I need to rethink of the uh... okay so I've shown this in a load of videos but if you just go on Etsy and I always search for hello I don't know why uh, we want to highlight this here um, we want to put in URL um, search queue didn't come up with anything Q equals Hang on. Hum. okay wait let me go on Google and type in uh, Etsy funny shirt this might actually help me get this a bit quicker market that's interesting but does it does that show on Google Ooh, interesting I didn't know that existed I'm not a robot I just work like a robot okay this is uh, interesting past 24 hours buy one get one Okay, so the, the idea here is you can do this in two ways. You can either put it on like um, any time and you can specify it to your niche. So let's say in title um, T-shirt. Let's say we're selling T-shirts, just random generic T-shirts. You can put any word here. Okay, you could put coffee, for example. And then we only get results with the word coffee in. But let's say we're selling coffee t-shirts instead. Um, let's get rid of the S. There's only 72 results, but, you know, it's uh, giving us hate coffee t-shirt. It's giving us good results, as you can see, for coffee t-shirt. Yeah, these are not going to be very good keywords, honestly, because it's too specific. But you can probably find things here, honestly, depending on what you're selling. If you're selling something that's as popular as a coffee t-shirt, you're probably going to do fine here. Um, it depends on how specific you want to be, but I don't, I don't really want to be specific. I prefer just because I'm looking for Redbubble keywords using this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put tools and I'm going to put past week. And yeah, I don't want a listing in the title at all. So in URL minus listing. Okay, there we go. Okay, so this can be used also generally for Etsy. Okay, so if you're selling things, let's say you sell handmade straw bags, you can just put the word Italian in the name and you will sell more. Uh, there seems to be a lot of baskets. If you're a basket seller, it might be time to get on uh, Etsy. Also, if you're a basket case. <laughs> Spring Cottage SVG Kids Cassette. Um, okay, so we want in title and we want sticker because I'm looking for red bubble keywords. Mm. Rick Roll sticker, BLM Ally sticker, Dead and Company, Keep Two Meters sticker. That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. That would be a really good shirt to start selling. Keep two meters. It's probably already been done to death. This will be, and this will have loads of results. Thinking about it. Oh, it doesn't actually have that many. I like this key. I really like this keyword. I think this will sell. 100%. I'm putting that. Keep two meter. Nice, 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 nice. I'm doing this live. I've done this kind of a little bit before, um, but I, I did it with Ahrefs. I don't think I've ever done using Etsy's search operators to find Redbubble keywords, so I don't really know if this is going to work, but it seems to be, seems to be fine. Um, how else can I make this show uh, something that would be good for Redbubble? I guess I need to kind of understand Etsy a bit more. What, what, they sell like jumpers and things. Our picks for you, Wix. I was doing SEO for weeks before. This is really interesting to me, these marketing bundles. 
they're really interesting. Yeah, Etsy is still kind of, and maybe if I go on shirts, this will give me some ideas. Shirts. I guess that means t-shirts. Nap queen. <laughs> I love that. Nap queen. Um, hmm. So it has a in title. It has a dash in it. Why is that not showing me anything? Hmm. Oh, I can just put the word shirt, obviously. Or not. Why is this no longer showing me anything? It's kind of weird sometimes this search operator method, I swear it like bugs out. Eight results, how is that possible? Maybe it's the marker thing. Let's just try this. Only eight results. There can't only be eight. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, no, wait. What? Maybe in URL. Oh, wait, I need to put it. I think that's going to completely change the whole results, I think. I don't, well, it's so weird. Like, Why does that one space change everything so much? So annoying. Alright, there we go. 1.6 million results. What? As if. Farmer's Market shirt. Sure, that's interesting. <laughs> Farmer's Market. Farmer's Market shirt. Sure. Farmer's Market shirt. Sure. Where's the old red bubble? There, there it is. There she blows. 4,000 results, nah. So what it does first, I think it shows the ones that have the word market in first, I'm pretty sure. Let's put this on um, more recent to try and identify some trends. That's what I'm really, really interested in, honestly. It's only got one result. 1968 C10, I don't know what that means. Oh, it's a... It's a car. I mean, you can just write, I have a 1968 C10, right? I'm pretty sure you can do that, but again, <laughs> check. Also, it's not coming up because of search intent. Goddamn search intent. Google, this kind of stuff, SEO was so much easier before search intent was a thing. MTV mom. Hmm. Oh, Redbubble's not even here. It might not be on Redbubble. MTV Mom. Yeah, there's no exact uh, phrase match, but it's copyright. I don't know if you can just write the word MTV. I really don't know how it works. Which is why I, I honestly suggest that you guys do your own copyright stuff. Because I don't come to me for copyright stuff. I don't even know who that is. Okay. Looks like a politician. But like people do this all the time. They'll just take his face, right? And say, I'm voting for, oh, uh, never mind, recall, it says. How many results? 468. It doesn't have any exact phrase matches. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't want to get in trouble, basically. <laughs> I just want to show people how to find keywords, but I'm always scared that someone's going to make a keyword that's going to get them in trouble. September shirt. Why is it only showing this few results, though? All results. Verbatim. That's not going to show anything, is it? No, it does. Oh, you can just change it to verbatim. Oh, no, it's back on any time. Past year, but, like, that's really unhelpful. It's not really what I want. Gujarati. <clears throat> oh my god. My throat just went. Ah, youth farm shirt. I don't know what that means. Okay, we could we could roll with this. We could roll with this. Hmm. 
None of them are none of them are exact phrase matches though, honestly. I'm gonna I'm gonna put this in. I think this is a good keyword. None of these are exact phrase matches. You could uh, you could take the market here, definitely. Fourth of July, Dogecoin. People need to be more careful with crypto. They don't really God bless America. You can just write God bless America on a shirt, right? That's perfectly fine. America's the word America is not copyright. <laughs> I think. I really don't know how it works. Six thousand results. Wow. But none of them any of them just God bless America. God bless the USA. Yeah, there we go. God bless America. You could probably get up here with a with an exact phrase, man. I'm just gonna put it on, honestly. Just use the exact phrase in your title and just see if it works. Okay, how far in are we? 21 minutes. Okay, I think um, fairly soon I'm going to switch to using Ahrefs. Let's just close all these. I'll stay like this for now. She from shirt. Interesting. She from Brooklyn. She from Brooklyn. <laughs> um... Oh, it's a bloody brand. Oh, that's a really cool idea, though. Fair play. That's a really good idea. I don't know why they would put one capital letter, though. I really don't like that. We are taking a small hiatus. What do you mean? What? <laughs> I mean, you you can just do that. Like, you can just write she from Brooklyn. You can just write like she from Brooklyn, she from wherever, she from London. Patriotic mom. <laughs> M2M. That must be two meters as well. No, I don't know what M2M means. What does M2M mean? Please don't be something weird. Please don't be something weird. Market to market. Oh, pop do it. Scuttle shirt. What a mom. What is that? Scuttle shirt. What does that mean? What? I mean, Rebels here are oh, Disney Scott. No. No, it's always copyright. God damn it. Right, let's just go back to using Redbubble's own website. I want to try something that I haven't actually done in a while. I'm going to specify some things here. So in title, uh, coffee, for example. Okay, 4,400 results. That's really, really good. So let's um, put it on the past week. Um... In title, oops. In title, coffee. And then, oh my god, I did it again. Okay, and then plus in plus um, gift. Is that gonna work? Yeah, nice. Halloween PNG coffee mugs. Okay, Halloween's coming up, so that is a really good keyword. I don't know what it means, but... Oh, they're all going to have coffee in. Why is this showing? This shouldn't be showing. I don't want other people's designs. I hate that. Okay, let's try instead of coffee... Okay, so something I've been looking at recently and thinking about recently is there's no reason you can't use, like, for example, this. This is someone else's design, okay? But you can use the words from this design. You can use a different font, a different color. Just forget about their design. Their design is not even transparent, which is really stupid, whoever made this. Um, I'm going to quickly Google this, and I'm going to see what comes up. 
obviously Redbubble does not because it's some it's a serious topic. So let's just. check the okay interesting i think this might be is this something that's a trend emerging maybe potentially i'm not really sure but yeah i've been thinking about i always say don't use other people's designs so i never i always filter these out but like just don't copy their designs and it's completely fine because this like all of these designs are already done around this keyword anyway so it's the same thing it's just this comes up on when using the search operator method and I've always tried to filter it out, but it's not really necessary, to be honest. Napoleon Dynamite, no. Sober and sexy. I like it, I like it. I really like it. Great keyword. Sober rock star. Sober and sexy, I love that. Oh. Sober and sexy. I'm not a robot. Okay, last updated 18 hours ago. This is what I'm talking about. Like this is this is fresh, fresh meat for for the for the biting. The kissing booth. No, guys, stop, stop. Tiffany and Co. duffel bags. Like, how is Redbubble allowed to do that? How? Just how? They shouldn't be allowed. Miraculous tales of a ladybug. Songs of faith and devotion. Nice. I don't know what this means, but... Oh, deep... Deep pesh mode. Is it a song? Yeah. It's an album. I haven't heard that album, actually. I might listen to that. Amal and the Sniffers. Jung Hyung. No idea how to pronounce that. So the re what I did was I put and because um, and is quite likely to give um, results that are really nice text-based designs. I really, really like text-based designs. I think they're the easiest to make. Okay, let's try past hour. See if anything comes up. No, past 24. So you want to kind of switch it up just to be shown different things. Like I was on a week for a while there and it was getting a bit stale. So I'm just going to put it on a month. Bold and bankrupt. I've already had that one. I'm Rick Harrison and this is my pawn shop. California Speed and Sports Shop USA. Yeah, most of these. Are, I just really, really want to keep people away from copyright. I want to discourage people as much as possible. This is a nice keyword though. And like, if you have the capability to do a little watercolor oh wow that's really interesting rebel has both the first results that's really cool i can imagine people search for this like honestly income watercolor shop does it come up no no it doesn't come up it depends how um if you're a good designer, a good drawer, anime, you can potentially do a little uh, drawing of a um, flower shop. That looks copyright, so skip. Dazed and Confused, Rick and Morty. As you can see, it's not not that interesting doing this, which is why I set up the Patreon, honestly, because it gets old after a while. I'm not really that ten and fabulous. I'm not really that interested in uh, uploading to Redbubble anymore because the, the money just is like in the future, and it's um yeah. I need to sort out my current situation first. Interesting. Only 14 results. Um, Etsy has how many results? 74. Ten and fabulous. I really like that. It's a really good keyword. Yeah, look, it, it's coming up, guys. Honestly, this, it's something that people will be searching for way more than Ahrefs is saying, you make that design, it will sell. I'm like 99% sure. I'm going to say 100% sure. Squirrel and Hedgehog. Is this just a squirrel and a hedgehog? Or...
So what I, what I normally do with a keyword like this is I just put a squirrel and a hedgehog, a random one together, and just uh, post them. Because you're just, I'm just uploading a picture of a squirrel and a picture of a hedgehog, like, and then putting squirrel and hedgehog in the title. It's not really my fault if it's a, uh, what's it called? Wait, don't get rid of that. If it's copyright, then, uh, you know, I'm just uploading a, a picture of a squirrel and a hedgehog together. What do you mean, copyright? <laughs> do you own all the squirrels and all the hedgehogs in the world? All the pictures of all the squirrels and all the hedgehogs? Or only the ones where they're together? <laughs> like, come on, it's just a picture. I don't know. If it's, like, really obviously copyright, then it's different. If I put, like, a picture of Harry Potter, <laughs> and I'm like, no, it's not Harry Potter. Foul legacy. It's a random person, it's not Harry Potter. Then obviously that's different, but yeah. Oh, these are all copyright, copyright, copyright. That's the problem with these research methods, honestly, it's just literally everything is copyright and oh, rare and ridiculous, I like that. And they don't seem to care, honestly, they really don't seem to care. They definitely do not go do a good job of keeping their stuff. Um, 16 Fabulous, nice. Keeping their stuff not copyright, like they must have huge problems. Oh, this could have a lot more results actually. It's gonna have way more. Yeah, it does. Damn. This would have been a keyword like four years ago. <laughs> oh, these designs are all really bad. No offense to <laughs> the people who did these designs, but I do not like a single one of them. Nice. I'm going to put that. For a Redbubble keyword, that's a good one, honestly. For Etsy, it's not, but for Redbubble, it is. Which is why sometimes I use Etsy to find Redbubble keywords. Uh, I want to try something. 50. I want to put the word, uh, I want to put a number here. Okay, just 50 and looking fabulous, that's fine. Only 60 results, guys. But, wait, this is on the past month. I can put this on the past year. No, nothing. Just 50 and looking fabulous, that's fine. Um, what about 60? Nothing. Well, I just found one, so that's not true, is it, Google? God damn it, Google. Maybe just 40? Oh, no, it's going to come up with loads of random things. Yeah, WD-40, like what? 40 counts to sky. Lucky number 40. Hmm. You can do all the lucky numbers. Lucky number one, lucky number two, lucky number three. Oh, there's more keywords here. 40 years grandma. Interesting. There aren't any designs here for this. I don't know. I'm just going to put it. 40 years and... 40 years and countless beers. Interesting. 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 Oh, also, it looks like they've just released another new item. I should make a separate video about this to get uh, more views and stuff, but I, I can't be bothered. If you're watching this, make this design. It's really, really good. And sorry, not make this design. Upload all your products onto um, Matt. Interesting. Wow. I just found a really good keyword by accident. Not even by accident, just another keyword method. Okay, well, I was actually out of keyword methods. I'm going to try this quickly because this seems pretty interesting. It's using Google. Oops, I just signed in. Didn't mean to do that. It's using uh, Google Auto Suggest. Interesting. There aren't that many designs on Redbubble, guys. Let's do this again. Wow, really, really cool. 40 years and counting. What do you mean, meaning? The meaning is obvious. How do you not know the meaning of that? Interesting. Interesting. Where's Redbubble? Interesting. It might not even be on Redbubble. Okay, guys. 
Every, everybody calm down a second. Where is Ahrefs? Everybody just calm down. Does this have volume according to Ahrefs? Not really. <laughs> okay, it's still a good keyword though. I like it. I'm, I'm going to switch up, see if I can think of a um, t-shirt, coffee and coffee and Jesus. Interesting. Coffee and Jesus. I kind of like this. Uh, I, I kind of like this cover, this this method, this keyword method. Uh, cats and coffee. I'll have loads. Wait, but we can maybe extend it. Cat drinking coffee shirt. Is that is that a thing? Do they drink coffee? Okay, it's got a lot of results. Um, let me just expand on this a little bit. I'm going to go into a different method. This was not planned at all, but uh, this was kind of the idea of the video was to just, just go through different methods. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on uh, keywordtool.io and I'm going to type in uh, cats and coffee. And it's on Italian. Why is it on Italian? Well, I know why it's on Italian, but why is it on Italian? No, please don't tell me that's Italian. Yeah, it's Italian. Aptos, the languages. Okay, uh, oh, it's not the way it works. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. This is another really good way to get keywords just generally as well. Let me just put it on United States just to... I'll let this load. I'll just pause for a second. Okay, so... Um, Let's just have a little look to see what we can find. Cats and what does that mean? Cats and cloud coffee aptos. I I don't know what that means. What is a what is a cloud coffee? What is this? Cats and cloud. Oh no! This is, this is gonna be weird. I think. Oh. Wait. What? I don't know what this is. I'm just gonna. I don't. I don't know what this is. That's fine. I really don't. <laughs> I'm gonna keep using the number thing. I think you guys can uh, try and think of your own. But I. I like the number. Oops. I just press search again. I hate myself sometimes. 14 pregnant. Wow. Good one. Yeah. Pff, wow. Wait, does that, does that exist? Not does that exist, does that got volume? Show me the volume! Show me potato salad. <laughs> Come on. Uh, it's medical though, isn't it? Yeah, bang, med oh, it's a film. Of course it's a film. 40 and shorties. <laughs> Excuse me? I'm not a robot though, like come on, please, I'm not a robot. It's another brand. 14 single, that's a really good keyword, potentially. Oh, this is oh, damn it. Why is it always a TV series or something? Okay, so let's just keep going through. 14, always tired. I love that keyword. Love it. Oh, it's uh, it's not really a t-shirt, though. I'm still going to put it because, yeah, I think it's a good one. Uh, let's try because Redbubble is for slightly younger people, I think. Let's try 18. And let's try and steer clear from uh, 14 Fabulous is such a good keyword. 18 and live, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18 and live to go. What is that? No, it's a song, obviously. <sighs> okay, I think this has a lot of potential. I just, I would need to fine tune this um, to show good results. 
doesn't just have to be um, 18, doesn't just have to be numbers. Um, let me just think. Okay, let's try um, naps and. So the idea is to think of words that will give results that we're looking for, and I think naps is definitely one of them. Yeah, look, naps and snacks, perfect, absolutely perfect. Please don't be about babies. Yeah, look, look at that. This is exactly what I'm talking about. So naps is something that looks really good on a t-shirt. Redbubble does not appear on the first page. It's very interesting. Yep, it's a great one. Let's go. Like, you can put anything here. Like, you could put, uh, like, a cat, for example. Naps and ADHD. Oh, no, this is... Naps and a two-year-old. Should a two-year-old be napping? Naps and brain health. Hmm. I like naps and you. There we go. Redbubble is not on the first page. Good. That means uh, if we add a design and it doesn't currently exist, we can help Redbubble get to the front page. Please think about what you're doing. Yeah, this is a good keyword, guys. Let's stick this here. I love, I love naps, milk, and social justice. Another great keyword. If you guys notice, every single time, um, Amazon is first, pretty much. Which, yeah. I've talked about this before, like if you're not on Am Merch by Amazon, then you are, you've got a problem basically, because they'll be selling a lot, a lot more than you. Uh, okay, that'll do for naps. Um, I'm gonna write, I like coffee. I'm determined to find some coffee keywords here. <laughs> Perfect. This is what I'm talking about. You just need to think about it a little bit. I really like that keyword. Again, this happens every time. Don't be dis discouraged from making a design, though. Ah, it's got loads of results. Wow. I like coffee and my dog and maybe three people. Yeah, it's got, it's got a lot of results. I'm not even going to bother with it. It must have been picked up by some kind of... Um, What's it called? Uh, tool, keyword tool. I like coffee, I like tea. I like coffee in the word. I like coffee and working in the city. A smell like coffee. Oh, oh it's, a, it's a YouTube video or something. Would I like a coffee? Yes. <laughs> Funny thing is, I'm sitting here writing about, or oh, researching coffee, and like I do kind of really like I kind of would really like a coffee right now. She's like cold coffee in the morning. Do you like coffee? I like coffee too. I like my coffee dark meme. It doesn't affect you after a certain amount of time. I like coffee how I like myself. I like my coffee too hot for you. Well, that's not very really nice. Oh, okay, it's a uh, so we would use that keyword there, um, which is this one. Whatever, you understand. It's uh, oh, I've got to write the whole keyword, otherwise it doesn't work. <laughs> Funny keyword. I like that uh, design idea. Mm. Why do I always do the wrong one? That just hasn't done what I want at all. Okay, good. I like coffee, I don't like tea. What is that? Oh, it's a nursery rhyme. I hate people. That'll be a good one. 
although most of it will just be people searching why they hate people. I hate people shirt. That's going to have loads of results. Yeah, a thousand on uh How many's red people got? Absolutely loads. Uh let's remove that and How do I I wish I could do it so that it showed me ones that had a different word here. That's that's why this tool is good because it does that. I hate everyone. I hate everyone ready set go. I hate everyone right now. No. I hate everyone YouTube. <laughs> is it normal to hate everyone while pregnant? Uh and pregnant. Hmm, nah, this is just gonna show me the wrong things. This is not what I want. Ooh, putting the word shirt there. That could be a good idea actually. Quarantine and pregnant shirt, dirty and pregnant shirt, red and white pregnant shirt, I'm pregnant shirt. <laughs> nah, they just have too many results. Pregnant with twins shirt, interesting. Like how many people actually become pregnant with twins? It must be quite a lot. Cafe press, expecting twins. 12,000 results. 947. Not bad. Not bad. We go with that. We dig. We dig. We're down. Cat twins hide during pregnancy. Can twins hide during pregnancy? Jesus. How to wear shirt while pregnant. Let's just try coffee shirt. Ideas. Yeah, that's the problem. Coffee shortage. Coffee addict shirt. That's an interesting one. It's funny how like an addiction to coffee, everyone laughs at it, but it's actually like it's actually like a pretty serious drug addiction. Jesus, that's a lot of results. Yeah, there's Stephen Rhodes. I swear, like he, he's the biggest seller. Coffee stain on shirt at work. Guns and coffee. <laughs> oh God, I love it. Absolutely love it. Guns and coffee. You can't do that, guys. You're not allowed to do that. Whatever. Do this, but not that design. Starfish and coffee. Interesting. Oh, it's a, it's a business. Coffee backwards shirt. Coffee chainsaw. Interesting. Uh, Red Bull. Good job with the advertising, Red Bull. Uh, we have to go on here, 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 here. Get rid of the word shirt. Oh, it, it already got rid of it. Uh, chainsaw carving and coffee makes me happy. Something like that. Yeah, it's perfectly fine. It's not not copyright. You don't have to put the word shirt in uh, in the if you're going to use the keyword methods um, the keyword list. You don't have to put the word shirt. Just so you know. Uh, e, f e fuck. I don't know what that means. E K G coffee. E K G. That's interesting. I know you might be saying, "Oh, why are you putting the word shirt in it? That kind of ruins it." But like, it's actually it's smart because people search for that. It's gonna have loads of results. Oh, it doesn't have that many results. Coffee, EKG. Nice. What time are we on? We've been going for 50 minutes. Coffee Evolution shirt. That's an interesting one. Oh, only 94 results. Love it. This is uh, really. This is really nice. Energized coffee shirt. Coffee, it's super effective shirt. I love that. Cardio and coffee. Mm, interesting. Mm. 
super effective. Interesting. Obviously, don't don't use Charmander in your design, but yeah. Okay, so let's keep going here. Coffee ground shirt. What does that mean? Like coffee grinds. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. It doesn't they're not exact phrase matches. We're gonna go with that. Coffee Galaxy. If you're a good designer and you can draw this, then all power to you. Oh, that's a lot. Hmm. T public. Just wanna see how many oh okay, no more. That's really cool. Like, that's exactly what I was talking about. A design like that would be really cool. I'm going to put it on just because it's a nice design. Nice design idea. So we've got 32 keywords in about an hour. Ahrefs is a lot quicker, but um, yeah, this gives you very up-to-date keywords. I, I think I'm actually going to call it there, guys. I was going to try and get to an hour exact, but I'm, I'm getting really, really tired, to be honest with you. And I've already released a video today about Jarvis so yeah thanks for watching uh, I made this for you guys because I don't want to forget about the Redbubble subscribers I know probably nobody is listening still but hello if you're still listening um, this is going to take like five hours to upload or something so you probably won't see this for another five hours but yeah uh, if you want to get the keywords from this video you can just write them down yourself from looking at it or you can uh, subscribe to my Patreon, and yeah, I've got a really bad headache, guys. I have to go. Peace out.